Ari, how's it doing, Lloyd? How are you going? What are you doing? Come on. Come on, Lloyd. Lloyd, come here. This is my neighbor's cat who keeps coming into my house. He's not my cat, but he likes my house for some reason. You know, I have one of those old school kettles that take forever to load, essentially. So yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> I'm feeling quite yellow. So I might talk to one of my works this week and be like, hey, hey, what do you think about toner? Like. Do you guys think that I should do one? Do you guys reckon I should leave it? How do you think it's looking? Um, yeah, because I want to go a more beigey color. Like, you, you know the color that I would really like, just because it matches with my regrowth, is um, it's sort of like the same color that like Kodakotti has or Taylor R even like that color because my regrowth okay is a very similar color to that and when you're behind the chair it's really hard to get in the chair so this is the reason that I don't usually wear normal foundation because I find it makes me somehow look younger and lots of people keep commenting on my age and whether or not I'm actually 27 not on YouTube but elsewhere and it's just like well I am 27 guys I, yeah I'm not posting my ID because for obvious reasons but it's interesting I've got my fruit tea or forest fruits tea um, this tea, I don't know if you can see, it, it's quite red. Uh, it's got a very wine-like color. And it's got, this cup is from Daiso. I wish I had the lid to show you because it was such a cute set, but I don't know where it's ended up. It's probably in a cupboard somewhere. I've got a few cups like this though. But the really cool thing about this tea is when, it, like, if I drink it in excess, I feel like my, like this is really gross, but I feel like my sweat starts to smell like it. And it's got the most amazing aroma. So that can't be a bad thing, especially in Australia. Now also, that's another thing. Now I'm gonna announce this here. I don't know when I'm doing it because I don't know when I'll have enough information and all that, but kind of stuff because it seems so obvious to me but I'm I'm gonna prove Australia is real guys yeah so in my previous video you saw that I did a debate with Rag Reynolds about whether or not Australia is real and it is real I I think that I'm going to prove it by sort of going through all of my checklists and all that. So what are the things that I want to prove? I want to pr prove that Australians do not live in New Zealand and that we have not been brainwashed. I want to prove that we're not drugged. I want to prove that New Zealand did not create Australia as a guise. I want to also prove that we're really lucky to live in Australia. I want to talk about our animals and whether or not they're as dangerous as what people think they are. I want to also talk about whether or not we're a bad country. I'll discuss Captain Cook who really and who actually discovered Australia because a lot of people think it was Captain Cook, but it was another country completely. 
and I also want to prove that Scotland is fake for the fun of it. I want to prove that I'm a, uh, I'm a real person and that kangaroos are not robots and Sydney is not part of the desert and boomerangs like the science of how they work and how magnets work so <laughs> it's going to be a little bit of a fun project so that's something to look forward to obviously because I'm going to be putting a lot of work in it and at this stage I'm working two jobs and doing full-time school I might not have time to do it all the time but hopefully over the next yeah, I'll have all of those videos out. So yeah, it'll be a lot of fun. Um, it's apparently flooding in Melbourne at the moment, so no problem. So this lighting is really bad. I'm at the train station. Uh, yeah, like. I've got these lights going on and I am waiting for a train. It's finally starting to get light. So when I leave it tends to be quite dark where I live because I live really far away from work. Hey guys, so I was planning on recording a little bit more today, but it's been kind of raining as you sort of saw what my getup was in the last clip. So I've also been to Daiso and I'm just playing around, forgive this, but I wanted to show you guys the amazement. I should really go like this, shouldn't I actually? Check it out. So we've got three. Let's hope this zooms in properly. I went to Daiso and I got all of these. All of them. And they have more. So I will be back for those cat hair clips. And yeah, I was just hanging out with one of my friends who's looking at starting YouTube apparently. So yay. Um, I'll let you guys know about her channel once she's gotten something up. But I feel like these are looking pretty epic and I this should be a trend okay this is like my scales right there okay so yeah um but those are the hair clips that I got from Daiso Japan so yeah my makeup looks really weird today like it looks like I'm not wearing makeup but I actually am in the camera I had lipstick on but it faded with all of the food that I ate, AK sh schnitz, schnitz chips, the chips from schnitz, that place that sounds like it's from Germany because schnitzels are German right? I don't know these things, so yeah. Standing in the something line there's a light on heavy room by the way i tried to say i'll be there waiting for yeah like i'm, I'm totally legit at covers like yeah it's like i'm totally good 